Um, Kelsey, just another really good scoring game for you tonight. And the first quarter, especially, the, the whole team really just seemed to come out firing. How do you personally like get in your headspace to where you know you're going to shoot the ball well? I uh, just kind of put out the energy uh, of the game and how it's going. Um, I feel like uh, as long as I find my spots and kind of like be where I'm supposed to be um, based on the space on the floor, um, obviously I just, you know, stick to my game, but to the point where I just try to fill in the gas based on where my teammates are. And then obviously three all-stars on this team, but also when you add in Melissa, like this is a very young team, but a good young team. Yeah. I think there was three people tonight with 20 plus points, three with double doubles. What does it say about this team where you guys are all able to perform so well, even with being so young? Um, I think that we're limitless. Um, I think that we're, the youth in us can kind of keep us going. Um, and the maturity behind our youth is um, is underrated. Um, these guys, it's not that first row, even though they're rookies, even though they're young players. Um, you can tell they have the maturity level to kind of stay resilient um, and battle down a stretch of games. And so I can appreciate that, especially with a quote unquote young team, because like I said, the chemistry that we have and we're developing now, I mean, you, you can't tell that we're young. We're just trying to figure it out day by day, but the youth has uh, less to do with it. You know, these guys kind of are, they've established a pro for sure. <laughs> Go Matt and Chloe. Yeah, Caitlin, you were threading the needle a lot today, like Kelsey to Aaliyah. Um, was there something just different about your game tonight being a point guard in a good way? I thought we just came out and played really aggressive. Um, I think that was. You know, kind of our mission from the jump is come out and attack, and that's what we did for three quarters. I thought our fourth quarter was a bit disappointing, but it's hard to attack and transition when you can't stop the ball. Um, we didn't get stops on defense, but overall, I thought we played three quarters of really good basketball, especially offensively, and then two good quarters of in the first half, especially on defense. Go Chloe and Dion back, right? Yeah, Kelsey, I kind of wanted to ask you the other side of that. Just what was working between you and Caitlin? Could you be able to grab those those balls and get those easy buckets? Um. The one thing I can appreciate about Kaylin is her vision and her ability to kind of get the ball up the floor. Um, you don't see it a lot, and so I can appreciate it because I, mean, I can utilize what I'm kind of decent at that's running. Um, so <laughs> if I'm open and I feel like I can, I'm in a position to kind of, you know, assist her or, make, or her assist me, I think we kind of play really good basketball that way. Yo, know, Dion. Uh, I'm Dion here at Fox Sports. Do you think that for the three quarters, both of you ladies, that this was the best offensive game that you had as a unit? And uh, I talked to you guys at the beginning of the year, and I thought it was, you know, the synergy between you, Aaliyah, and Caitlin. Um, do you feel like you guys are kind of getting to that level now where you guys could be thought of as one of the best trios in the league? Uh, I definitely think that we've, we've kind of balanced out how can we all, how we can all feed our games off one another, and it kind of plays in our favor because I don't think that we go out there with a mindset of like, I don't want to play with this person. I don't want to play with that person. I think they would play really, really, we gel really, really well naturally based on what we do individually and how we can accumulate it together as a group. Um, but I would say, like, our, us as a team, I think it's going to start to put, you know, the league on notice because our grit, um, our resiliency down the stretch of games. And I think that we can do our, do better competing, but I think that we have, you know, been in the trenches enough to know that we can kind of win some of these games. Good. Best game of the well, for three quarters, I I think those are the best. I like four quarters. Okay. Yeah, for sure. For sure. That's all I got. Okay. Done. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, Caitlin, you know, assists are one thing, but it just feels like how much pride do you take in setting your teammates up so perfectly with the precision of your passes and just it seems like they're not just assists, they're they're like very special assists in that way. How much pride do you take as a point guard in doing that? Yeah, it's so fun, like just getting to pick apart the defense, especially when like we get stops in, on on defense and get to go in transition. Like I just get excited and like honestly, like a lot of my turnovers that's where they come from. Like just trying to play exciting basketball in transition. Um, but I mean, I don't know. Like at times, I feel like I, I can almost overpass because like I want to set them up so badly that like I almost kind of lo lose vision of like the basket at times or like you know I'm almost thinking like to pass the ball and kind of forget about shooting that at times. But um, I don't know. I think it like it adds a whole other dimension of what the defense kind of has to scheme for. It's like, you know, I'm going to try to set up my teammates the best I can, but at the same time, I want to be able to score the ball. So the more I can do that, um, the better it's going to be for our team overall. Go Matt and Kelsey. Yeah, Caitlin, you were matched up with Celeste pretty often tonight. Mm -hmm. I guess what was that kind of like just to go mm -hmm. against your former teammate three weeks later? 
Yeah, it's kind of weird. Um, I'm happy for her, though. She's a tremendous player and obviously a tremendous person. And I had so much fun when she was here with, with us in, in Indy. And um, she was a heck of a teammate. Um, and I think that's a, a great person to sign. Um, she's somebody that's just going to work as hard as possible. Like I know she just got with them yesterday, and I thought she honestly came out and played a really good game. Um, she only had one point, but like she was a plus 10 um, in a game at a point where we're up 30. So um, that's just Celeste. Like I've been her teammate multiple times. Um, she's going to do a lot of different things on the floor and play as hard as she can. So I'm just, I'm just really happy for her. Last two, Kelsey and Kyle. For both of you or either of you, we've talked about the highs and lows of this group. One of those lows was on Wednesday. Just what impressed you guys the most of being able to get, take one day off and come out and respond with a win? Uh, I think this league is one of those leagues where you can't necessarily dwell on, you know, past games. And I think all we, all we could have done based on how we played Wednesday we kind of, was kind of flush it. Um, but I think it shows us to that resiliency. I was telling you guys about it earlier and that toughness. Um, this game is mental more than it is physical. Um, I always tell people that this is a mental game. And I think mentally you was able to switch focuses and, you know, turn up page to Friday. And I think it showed in, in the game today. Kyle, last one. Uh, Caitlin, I talked with Brittany before the game, and she kind of just commended and applauded the way that you've been able to transition into the WNBA while also kind of handling the fame and attention that comes with it. Um, just to hear that from a veteran and an all-time great like that, what does that mean for you? Yeah, it's super kind. And she said the same thing to me when we played in Phoenix um, earlier this year. and. Um, it's just something you appreciate. Like as long as I've watched this league, like she's been a staple in this league and been absolutely tremendous. So for her to say that is is not something you take light, lightly and just something I really appreciate.